If I have seen further it is by standing on the shoulders of giants. I can calculate the motion of heavenly bodies but not the madness of people. Nature is pleased with simplicity. And nature is no dummy. What we know is a drop, what we don't know is an ocean. Tact is the knack of making a point without making an enemy. Gravity explains the motions of the planets, but it cannot explain who sets the planets in motion. Truth is ever to be found in the simplicity, and not in the multiplicity and confusion of things. No great discovery was ever made without a bold guess. A man may imagine things that are false, but he can only understand things that are true. If I have ever made any valuable discoveries, it has been due more to patient attention than to any other talent. He who thinks half-heartedly will not believe in God, but he who really thinks has to believe in God. Live your life as an exclamation rather than an explanation. You have to make the rules, not follow them. Sir Isaac Newton was asked how he discovered the law of gravity. He replied, by thinking about it all the time. To myself I am only a child playing on the beach, while vast oceans of truth lie undiscovered before me. Tact is the art of making a point without making an enemy. Trials are medicines which our gracious and wise physician prescribes because we need them, and he proportions the frequency and weight of them to what the case requires. Let us trust his skill and thank him for his prescription. If I have seen further than others, it is by standing upon the shoulders of giants. To explain all nature is too difficult a task for any one man or even for any one age. Tis much better to do a little with certainty leave the rest for others that come after than to explain all things by conjecture without making sure of anything. Whence arises all that order and beauty we see in the world. To explain all nature is too difficult a task for any one man or even for any one age. Plato is my friend, Aristotle is my friend, but my greatest friend is truth. Yet one thing secures us whatever betide, the scriptures assures us that the Lord will provide. If I have been able to see further, it was only because I stood on the shoulders of giants. I have studied these things, you have not. Truth is the offspring of silence and meditation. I keep the subject constantly before me and wait till the first dawnings open slowly. By little and little, into a full and clear light, in the absence of any other proof, the thumb alone would convince me of God's existence. To every action there is always opposed an equal reaction. There are more sure marks of authenticity in the Bible than in any profane history. I can calculate the motion of heavenly bodies, but not the madness of people. If others would think as hard as I did, then they would get similar results. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Gravity explains the motions of the planets, but it cannot explain who set the planets in motion. As a blind man has no idea of colors, 
so have we no idea of the manner by which the all-wise God perceives and understands all things. If I have done great things it's because I was standing in the closet of smart men taking notes and then publishing their ideas as my own. They who search after the philosopher's stone are by their own rules obliged to a strict and religious life. A man may imagine things that are false, but he can only understand things that are true, for if the things be false, the apprehension of them is not understanding. For I see not what there is desirable in public esteemed, were I able to acquire maintain it. It would perhaps increase my acquaintance, the thing which I chiefly study to decline. The more time and devotion one spends in the worship of false gods, the less he is able to spend in that of the true one. If I have seen farther than others, it is because I was standing on the shoulders of giants. Tis much better to do a little with certainty leave the rest for others that come after than to explain all things by conjecture without making sure of anything. What we know is a drop. What we don't know is an ocean. This most elegant system of the sun, planets, and comets could not have arisen without the design and dominion of an intelligent and powerful being. We are to admit no more causes of natural things than such as are both true and sufficient to explain their appearances. Atheism is so senseless. When I look at the solar system, I see the earth at the right distance from the sun to receive the proper amounts of heat and light. This did not happen by chance. We account the scriptures of God to be the most sublime philosophy. I find more sure marks of authenticity in the Bible than in any profane history whatever. If I have come further, it is by standing on the shoulders of giants. Hypotheses non fin go, Latin for, I feign no hypotheses, I frame no hypotheses, or, I contrive no hypotheses. To explain all nature is too difficult a task for any one man or even for any one age it is much better to do a little with certainty and leave the rest for others who come after you. Gravity must be caused by an agent acting constantly according to certain laws, but whether this agent be material or immaterial, I have left to the consideration of my readers.